Is Disney's Animal Kingdom closing in 2024? Today, we are addressing the rumors. Here's a viral video currently making its way around TikTok. At the time of this recording, it's garnered nearly 3 million views and counting. The video states, Disney's Animal Kingdom may be closing permanently. Rumors have started swirling around that Animal Kingdom will close in 2024. Disney would celebrate its 25th anniversary in 2023 and then close it. This is due to high costs and low revenue with it being the least visited Disney park. But is there any truth to that claim? No. Animal Kingdom is not closing in 2024, nor is there any major park closure in store for Disney World in the foreseeable future. The TikTok video is just another viral hit from a new Disney-themed parody site called The Mousetrap. If the name of the company itself isn't a big enough tip-off for the average reader or viewer, The Mousetrap isn't a real news site. It's a satire site. It's basically like a Disney-themed version of The Onion. Are parody news accounts legal? In the United States, jokes, parodies, and satire are considered to be creative expressions protected by the First Amendment. That's not to say these sites are free to do whatever they please. They still need to abide by libel law and fair use guidelines, which pertain to reusing original copyrighted work to create their fictional pieces. But as a whole, yes, it seems parody is perfectly legal. Plus, the mousetrap makes its satirical intent pretty clear through disclaimers that are clearly posted on its TikTok profile, as well as all over their website. But that doesn't stop real news outlets from picking up the stories. Here's the weird part. Only half of us appear to be in on the joke. In fact, a quick glance through the comments section of their videos reveals a surprising number of people that seem to think that the headlines are real. And some of their craziest headlines, such as Disney Files patent for roller coaster that jumps track, have even been picked up by local TV stations. As recently seen on Fox 32 Chicago, Jimmy Fallon also picked up the coaster story, which aired on The Tonight Show. But instead of making fun of the local news station, Fallon simply made jokes about the Fox 32 segment, as if it were real. As easy as it would be to place blame on the mousetrap for spreading fictitious news, the blame really falls on the gullible, particularly any trained media professional who doesn't bother to check their facts. And now for the key takeaway. With all that said, we still think it's important for individuals to learn to know the difference between fictional news, satire, and real reporting. You can't believe everything that you see on social media. And remember, for official information about Walt Disney World, always go directly to the source. Have you heard this rumor? Let us know in the comments. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you don't miss our next video from HeyOrlando.com.